Well, the Minnesota Pollution Control Agency warned today that the impact of climate change is already severely affecting cities and homeowners across the state. The MPCA says right now 155,000 Minnesota homes are at risk of flooding. So are 29,000 roads and 13,000 commercial buildings. As Esme Murphy reports, those numbers are only expected to rise. Thank you to everyone who is here with us today. To the MPCA held a virtual climate change meeting with community leaders from Bewabek, Richfield, and New Ulm to show climate change is statewide. We have seen more intense precipitation events occur more frequently. You're seeing more localized flooding in areas that historically you may not have seen flooding. Leaders in New Ulm say severe rains are their biggest problem. In Bawabak, unpredictable rain and snowfalls are hurting tourism year-round. Still, people don't think of these smaller communities as being that impacted by climate change. Let's take a look at Richfield, the inner ring suburb. Well, officials here estimate that climate change has cost taxpayers here hundreds of thousands of dollars, including right here at the Woodlake Nature Center. In 2019, a massive rain washed out this walkway. The replacement cost? $250,000. Frequent high rain events are flooding new areas. We have like a community Facebook page and people are putting on there like I need help because my basement's flooding and we're hearing about that more and more. WCCO's Mike Augustinak is a certified consulting meteorologist qualified to consult on climate change issues. What should communities around the state know about what lies ahead when it comes to climate change? The two big factors for Minnesota that will impact all of us are warming winters and more extreme precipitation, meaning times where we are flooding and times when we are droughting, but less of the average in between. Esme Murphy, WCCO 4 News.